Hey everyone, hey everyone. This is Earth Angel, Goddess Oracle, back with another reading for the collectives. Welcome, welcome, welcome to all my new subscribers. Welcome. All right, so first thing first, you guys know I am not a tarot reader, I am a prophetess. I use cards just to connect with you guys, just to connect with the overall energies for the collectives and their person. Over here is a self love journey. We go through the grow through, we take those lessons and create blessings out of everything that we go through. So I don't do personal readings. I don't answer personal questions. I focus on the things you guys need to know, not want to know. So if you guys want what I offer, it's called a Healer's Corners message. And that's a message from your spirit guides and your angels. Exactly what you need to hear, not what you want to hear. So simply send me your name and date of birth. You can go on the community board to see how to receive a message from me. 1818 is a donation. Please follow the steps on the community board. Please allow 21 days for me to get back to you guys. All right, y'all, so you know I'm pre-recording, so I got to make this kind of cute, not too freaking long, because I'm sorry, I got two more readings to do. And I'm like, you know, this is pre-recording, so I didn't leave yet, but I'm going to be in NOLA when y'all see this, but I'm going to tap in with you guys, of course, okay? This is Saturday's evening's reading, and um, it's definitely given somebody is trying to make some type of fucking change, like literally. Like, they just want a fresh start with the food cart there. Like, somebody just want to do things differently. So, whoever this person is, this is somebody who's watching you guys. That's been watching y'all. That's been repeating the same fucking cycles over and fucking over again. And it looks like now this person is making a clear decision that they want to stop. They're going to stop celebrating. They're going to break up with whoever they're dealing with so they can take some leap of faith in your direction. Okay? This is like some new shit to them with the food card. They don't do risks. They don't take risks. They don't do nothing. This is what they feel like they got to do. So, hmm. Let's see what's going on with this energy. All right. So, Spirit, please take this reading. Only allow positive energy into this reading. Only allow what is called a palm, which is positive energy. See your spirit, guys, and angels to protect me. Allow me to see the things you want me to see and what God wants me to see and know. All right, y'all. So, hmm. Y'all already know if y'all need any of my services on the community board. If you guys want to know, um, want to purchase my candles, y'all know Serene Naturals, S-E-R-E-N-E-N-A-T-U-R-A-L-S -E -E underscore. The link is in the bio. Go check out the Instagram. And if you want to purchase, the link is in the bio of the Instagram. Okay, y'all? Whatever you guys need is on my community board. So y'all can go over there. I don't do personal readings or personal questions, but I do give you guys what's called a healer's corners message or an advice message. So follow the steps over there. Give me 21 days to get back to you guys. 18, 18 is a donation, but you got to follow the steps correctly or there will be a delay. All right, y'all. So let's tap in. Hmm. Reason why Spirit has me reading about this is... um. This person sees you guys as their twin flame. They do. Mm-hmm. Yep. They want to be with you. Because look at this. The four ones reverse. They don't want to deal with those people or that person. They want to be with you. They want to celebrate with you. Um, they want to have a family with you. So it looks like whoever this is, this could be your twin flame. Somebody's twin flame that wants to apologize to y'all for being fucking a narcissist or being mad at you. And not get, that's really what it is. This person was being fucking mad at you at the wrong motherfucking person, not giving to you because of their past, because of their past. It has nothing to do with you. And so now this person's now regretting not investing to this connection, right? Seeing things in a different perspective, right? And then this person's angry at themselves for not working on the connection with you guys, for being immature. And they want to apologize for not working on the connection with you guys. I feel like this person now seeing things differently. And they want to kind of chase you now. I ain't going to hold you. They want to come towards you quickly. They want to come fast. Okay? They want to chase you. I feel like this person is going to come out of fucking nowhere with this shit too. It's like, where the fuck you came from? I don't want it. I feel like y'all going to be like, I don't want it. I don't need it. I don't know what the fuck. Because with the bottom of the deck, it's like, this person, you know this person for being this page of wands. A flirtatious person that like to finesse and use their words. You're not going to want to hear shit coming from this person. So, let's see why Spirit got us reading this. Spirit, why do you want me to read to this to the collectives? What is the reason why you had me doing reading this? What, what, what do they need to know about this information?
Mm. Mm. Oh, that's what you need to know. This person is blocked from being able to come towards you and invest into this connection until they tell you the fucking truth. That's what it is. Honestly, they block from even moving on. This person ain't gonna be able to move on with nobody. And in fact, this fuck just you. Coming towards you, yeah. This person's blocked from coming towards you to, to invest into anything because of the truth. But this person's blocked from even moving on with anybody or anything and investing with anybody until they speak their fucking truth. This person will be haunted for the rest of their fucking life. They will not have any real relationships. They won't have any stability. This person is 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 not going to have shit going on for them until they tell you the fucking truth. And what the fuck's really being going on and how they really fucking feel about you. Mm. Yep, exposed. Yep. With the sun card. Yep. They got to tell you about it. They got to expose themselves for what the fuck they've been fucking doing and why they've been keeping their fucking distance. Yep. Yeah? They got them. Yep. Yep. And why the fuck they break from your ass. Right? Or why they had an opportunity. They had an opportunity. They feel like they had an opportunity with you to heal things. And they didn't. You feel me? Yep. But they chose. But they, they, they had to make some type of choice that they didn't want to. They had other fucking lovers. Yep. And released you, right? And gave you false promises. They got to they gotta expose all of this shit. They will not be able to move on in peace with anybody. Fuck just you. They can't even come towards you and even try to think they can invest in anything with you until they tell you the truth. But they're not even going to be able to move on with anybody else until they do either. They're going to be haunted for the rest of their life. It's like they got to tell you the truth about all of this. Yep. See what I'm saying? How they didn't do this, you know, because of their pride. This person has to give you justice, Spirit is saying. They do. They have to be fair to you. They have to give you some type of justice for being in you. They have to. Spirit is saying. And that's by exposing fucking truth. They have to. They have no other choice. Yep. And what's so crazy is um, this person now who abandoned you now see you as they wish for fulfillment and you you done with them. You're done with them. And now they having fucking regrets. Yep, because you the fucking empress. Ain't nobody better than you. You actually was loyal to them. You was their strength. Yep, and now they in the tower moment because now they fucking realizing this shit. Like, oh my God. Like, I done fucked up with an empress. The best of the fucking best. Like, am I dumb? I gotta be dumb. Mm, 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 mm. Look, look, and now look at this motherfucker. Like, I, 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 I meant we supposed to be together forever. I want to be with you forever. I want to be with you forever. Mm. But this person had you competing with other people. Had all these options. Had you competing and manipulating. Yep, juggling you. Undecided. And now look, they want to apologize. For not taking the opportunity that you was fucking given. Mm-hmm. Yep, because now they see you as their fucking true love. Look at this shit. Damn. Look at them trying to come back. They want to marry you with the emperor here. They want to fucking marry you, bro. That's They thinking like you are it for them. You are it now because they done, de they done dealt with all these other people outside. And realize ain't nobody better than you. Now they realize you are the one for them. They went outside and played and ain't nobody like you. Can I come back home? That's just, can I come back home? I'm sorry, I realized it. I was a fool for not taking the opportunity, the blessing that I was being presented with. I need to, I gotta apologize for you for not taking it, taking this opportunity. This blessing. Y'all being fucking sneaky. Mm. Sneak, sneaking around with you and somebody else. Because of family. Lying too. They could have been lying to you, lying on you to a karmic. Because of family. And now this person's being haunted. They did a lot of shit you probably don't even fucking know about. Yep. 
They're being haunted and they're going to have to transform if they want to move on. That's what spirit is saying. They ain't got no other choice. They will be haunted for the rest of their fucking life until they make some type of fucking change. Until they make some type of transformation. That's just what this is giving. Straight like that. So it looks like this person's realizing this shit. Like, oh my God, I got to do something differently. So it looks like that's what they're about to do. And it happens when your ass is the fuck out of here, right? <laughs> it happens as soon as you guys are done with their asses. Mm-mm-mm. Anything else that they need to know, Spirit, about this energy? Dating. Oh, so, ooh, just closing out a cycle. So this person's been dating, and it looks like they're closing out this cycle because they're missing you and they're triggered. So I don't know what the fuck you guys are doing. I just feel like you guys are just unapologetically being you, doing what the fuck you want to do. Yep. Yep, trigger. Look, air signs. Could be somebody who has it in their chart. You know, I don't read signs. But this is somebody who's like trying to figure out how to solve this issue with you. You understand what I'm saying? Doing a lot of thinking. And I feel like this person wants to speak some type of truth too. Because the air is like, it's communication. Yep, no contact. Yep, they want to talk to you. Somebody you're not in contact with. Yep. And this is like giving me the higher friend card in reverse about this person being non committal. Now it's like this person wants whoever you ain't talking to right now who's non committal. Or who didn't learn a lesson, who wasn't taking that advice, causing conflict. This motherfucker now scared as a bitch now. Scared. And they was doing it, I feel like this person was scared of your fucking energy that you was giving. Because they wasn't used to that. They was used to that low vibration of shit. And that's why this is somebody who was emotionally unavailable to you. Because they didn't have that same energy. It scared them. The love you gave. And some type of dream they had is making this person want to change. Yup, this person right now who's emotionally immature is now fucking hurting over you. So they had a dream about you. And they probably saw your future. You feel what I'm saying? Or saw you and them together, supposedly supposed to be together, or that might not ever happen. It might just be a dream now. Whatever dream they had is making this person want to fucking make a change. Mm-hmm. For some, they, a, a dream of them is probably them being single for the rest of their life or them not having a family. Yep, so look, here they go. They want to apologize for manipulating you. Mm-hmm. For somebody else or trying to manipulate you with using somebody else that they had some type of chemistry with. Planning to ghost you. Wow. Mm-hmm. Mm -mm -mm. This person had some shit with them. Tuh. Woo! Because now, look, this person now was trying to learn self-love now so they could fucking come talk to you. That's what it looks like. So this person now is ghosting people, reflecting, going into hermit, gaining some wisdom so they can come fucking talk to you. Mm-hmm. Damn. 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 And that's even their intentions was horrible. This is why spirit is saying you're not going to ever be able to move on. This person will never be able to move on until they do what the fuck spirit told them to do. Period. So, mm. let me give you guys an oracle because that's just about fucking it. This person now is scared. They were scared of your fucking energy you was fucking giving. And that is immature person. Is now fucking hurting. They act, they hurting like a motherfucker. Now. Whatever dreams they thought they had. They was going to have with you still after all of this stuff. That shit is changing. Because <laughs> your ass is out the fucking door. Because they wanted to be immature. And now they fucking hurting. So look, this person's making some type of change. They, they feel, Now it's like, okay. I didn't want to do any changes. But... I really didn't think I was going to be able to live my life without the collectives. I always thought I was going to be able to come back. I need to do something differently. So this person now making a decision to end something and take a leap of faith with you. I don't know how that's going to work. I doubt you happy about that. After everything they fucking did. Mm. All right, spirit. What angel card do you have for the collectives to close out? Yes. This is confirming. And what is 
with the sun card. Yep, this person who blocked you is going to be exposed. They're going to expose themselves. Yep. Look at this. Healing. A lot of healing is happening. Spirit saying remain positive. Mm. This person is going to try to compromise with you, but Spirit is telling you to keep your fucking yourself guarded. It's going to happen in the near future, too. So it's coming up soon. Yep. Some type of recovery. Some type of healing. So don't worry about this shit, though, Spirit saying. Don't be worried about none of this stuff. What's going to play out. Don't be worrying. This person looks like they, they got they got their karma, Spirit is saying. They got their fucking karma. While you got other options and opportunities coming in. So, you feel me? That's just what the fuck is going on. All right, y'all. So, that's what I got for y'all. I love you guys so much, y'all. So, see you guys soon. Bye, you guys.